Hi everyone! So we are the J and S Mentoring Network in association with the Zambia Cultural Research Institute. As a team, our passion is to help small-scale farmers in Zambia who are mostly women to improve their common bean or dry beans production and increase their income and therefore become economically empowered. One challenge that we have in Zambia is that the production of common beans is very low. And so for farmers to like boost this production, they need to add inorganic um, fertilizers. And these are unfortunately expensive for the small scale farmer. We uh, have visited several um, small scale um, farms in um, Kafia district, Lusaka, Zambia. And um, we were able to ask them what the challenges were and able to, to establish that we need a solution. And this solution is called is the inoculum. The inoculum or natural biofertilizer that will help to boost um, the production of common beans and is also economically for Now, while this innovation is not new on a global scale, in our um, community, this is actually very new and it's, and, it's, and it's going to help many, sm many small scale farmers who cannot afford um, the expensive version fertilizers need to also be um, a way that can help us also find something that is economically and ecologically friendly. So currently we know that for a common green farmer to be able to cater for like one hectare of farmland they need about 200 kg of inorganic fertilizer. Okay. And so today, 50 grams, 50 kilograms of kg of fertilizer costs about 500 kwacha. Now, if you convert this to US dollars, it might seem like it's nothing. But to one of our small scale farmers, this is very expensive. And so if they have to cater for one hectare of land with this cost of, of, of fertilizer, they need to spend about 2,000 kwacha, which is very expensive for us small scale farmers. But our innovation of an inoculum for common bean actually cuts down this cost by 99%. A farmer can just spend 20 kwacha instead of 2,000 kwacha and cover the same amount of land and boost the production. Then they'll have more money left, increase, um, increase their their income and therefore become empowered. So how do we do this? Stay with me. Well, we know that common beans, like all other um, type of plant, similar plants called legumes, they are able to obtain their own natural fertilizer, which we're calling a biofertilizer. They do this by interacting with bacteria in the soil that are called rhizobia. These bacteria interact with the roots of the common bean and then provide this nitrogen for the plants to grow. And so as a team, what we did is we went to these several farms, small scale farms in Kafia district, and we were able to then like isolate these several different um, uh, rhizobia bacteria that are specific for um, different common bean varieties that are grown by, this, uh, by these small scale farmers. And our goal is that with these bacteria will be used to make a biofertilizer or an inoculum that can be mass produced and then given to the farmers to apply to their to apply to their seeds prior to planting and then they'll be able to get this um, boost in production so we present this innovation to you this is going to help our small scale farmers cheaply and sustainably improve common bean production while being empowered economically